definitely cold all right so we just got in the shop today got the uh, parts painted in the last video which was last night as you guys saw in the last segment um, got brand new brake pads this morning had to run around a couple uh, parts stores to get them um, so Rick we just went ahead and bought you brand new brake pads I mean assembling these uh, front brakes you know and we want it to look mint so we picked up front pair of brand new brake pads that way it looks fresh on the install. You did have uh, new hardware already, so we don't need none of that. Um, the back uh, brake pads look fine, so we're just going to throw those back in there. And uh, so Brent uh, went ahead and uh, painted the uh, front and rear rotors black. That way this looks all mint. They're just dusty right now. But here's Rick's old um, pads. You can see someone's like painted them fucking blue or some shit. Plasti did. I don't know. So we're going to push this back install the front rear brakes um put the uh parking brake cables back on and then we're, we have to bleed it and then uh we'll be set the car does uh you know run and drive right now but we just can't uh use the brakes so uh we'll back it up jack her up bleed the brakes properly and then uh we'll uh, be wet sanding and buffing the car and then tomorrow we'll fully assemble we're gonna let the uh fenders uh and bumpers dry a whole nother day because it is cold today and uh, we should be set um, we do have something coming up uh, we're gonna pick up a present for Christian for Christmas either tomorrow or Saturday so uh, in the next couple videos you guys will be seeing that so um, I'm not gonna say anything right now and you think Christian's gonna like the surprise Brent if he doesn't I'm gonna just unfriend him I'll make him I unsubscribe. Feel bad. His car's not done, so that's why we gotta do this, you know. Yep. So Christian, we got a surprise coming up. So, <sighs> but we are getting your car done. We got the front and rear bumpers done. We're gonna strip the hood probably when we get back from Nebraska, and uh, I don't know, do some other stuff. We have to pull. I don't know if we're gonna do the engine bay or not. You said you don't care. I'd say why not do the engine bay? It's a real Celine. We're gonna paint the whole outside. Um. And then we'll just pull the K-member engine and everything at once, put the long tube headers on and everything like that. So it just, it's just up to you, you know, whether you want to buy all new suspension for it because it's all rusty as hell looking. Um, I'd say I want to do the engine bay. I know it's a lot of work. Fox bodies always have a bunch of wiring and stuff. It's all cluttered under there. So I don't know. We'll just we'll go about it however you want, Christian. So uh, let us know in the comments. So anyway, we're going to jack this thing up and uh, bleed the brakes right now. So uh, first, let's uh, go ahead and assemble the uh, brake calipers. We wet sanded the entire side with 2,000 by hand in the block, and then we went back over it with 3,000 on the DA, and then we did 5,000 on the DA. Then I uh, got the buffer out and compounded it out twice, each panel twice, wiped it off, checked it, and then I finally hit it with some um, ultra fine uh, polish with the uh, buffer on slow. So this is the results right now after it's wiped down. Um, then we're still going to uh, apply some of the chemical guy wax uh, at the end. But uh, we got this side done, ready to assemble. And then this side has not been buffed yet, but it's been sanded with 5,000 on the DA pad. So that's why it looks flat. It almost looks like there's no clear coat right now. 
But as, it, as you all can see, it's darker on this side just because the lighting, we got that big light right there. So we're gonna assemble this side and then we're going to um, turn it around and uh, buff and then assemble the other side. And then tomorrow we're gonna do the fenders, hood, bumpers and all that stuff. So right now, uh, enjoy the time lapse. We're gonna assemble the car.